Symbolization is the process of choosing how to represent the features on a map. The symbols we choose should help describe additional information about the features on the map. Poor symbolization leads to inaccurate, misunderstood, or even deceptive information, while effective symbolization helps to communicate information quickly and clearly. To perform symbology, you need to import your layers into the software. Here we have the polygon and lines layer. To do symbology, you need to go to your layer and right-click, select the Layer Properties option. We can change the appearance type. Click on the layer. You can also change the symbol layer type. You can choose the color combination. There are various color combinations in the select fill color window. You can specify the color combination manually. You can display your layer based on HSV and RGB as well. By clicking on your layer, you can have all kinds of samples to display the layer. It is the same for lines. You can specify the color combination manually. You can display your layer based on HSV and RGB. You can increase or decrease the width for lines. Project styles can be selected based on needs. Choose the appropriate project styles for line layers. You can use various display modes and display layers in different ways. For our layer we used a different color combination. so that each polygon is placed in a group with a specific color combination. In order to get an output or layout from your layers and maps, you need to proceed according to the tutorial. Here is the changed coordinate system of the new layer.
we do this step again. And change the coordinates based on UTM this time. You can change the coordinates of your layers to have better processes in this way.